guys! So I've been getting a lot of comments and questions asking about what my major is. So today I thought that I would kind of explain to you guys what it is and how I kind of came to that conclusion. So to begin with, when I was little I always wanted to be a teacher. For the longest time that's what I saw myself doing. And it was probably until I was about 14 that I decided that teaching really wasn't in the cards for me. I have some patience, but I don't know that I have a lot of patience to deal, especially with like little kids, and that's probably the teaching that I would want to go into. But um, I just decided that wasn't really what I wanted to do. So then I really wanted to go to culinary school. I thought that it was so cool, so interesting. I was really into watching like the Food Network and Cake Boss and all of these different shows that were on, and I really liked the baking, bakery, um, confections sort of um, side of cooking. And I would absolutely love, even to this day, to have my own little cupcake bakery and just make my little cupcakes and different little um, pastries and stuff. I think that'd be a really cool idea, but it's so hard to open a new business. But um, I think that'd be awesome. I would really, really enjoy that. But I kind of decided that culinary school was really iffy, you know, um, you could come out, you know, amazing and get amazing job and have, you know, so much success, but then you could also just kind of flop and it could not really amount to anything. So I kind of wanted to take a safer route. So then I kind of decided I was going to go into marketing and I was stuck on marketing for probably a year. My dad's job deals a lot with marketing, so I just found it really interesting and I kind of got some backhand experience and stuff just kind of, you know, watching him work and doing what he did. Um, and I just thought it was really cool. I like the creative side of it, you know, creating ads and different promotional things to market, you know, a team or a city or whatever it was. I thought that that was interesting. But then my senior year in high school, I was editor of my school's yearbook. And my yearbook advisor, who was also my English teacher previous years, so I had her my sophomore, junior, and senior year. Her daughter was diagnosed with a brain tumor and she had to have surgery and she had to have chemotherapy and was at St. Jude's for a really long time and she's doing really, really great now. So that's really, really awesome. But um, while she was going through all of this stuff, I really thought to myself, how can I make a difference? So I really um, wanted to be a pediatric surgeon. Um, I actually wanted to be this up until right before I started my freshman year in college. I wanted to be pre-med and um, probably major in like biology or chemistry or something and be a pediatric surgeon. But then the more I thought about it, the more I was like, I don't know if that's really the right choice for me because you have to go four years to get your undergraduate degree and then you go four years at medical school and then once you graduate medical school you go into residency and that can go you know anywhere from two to four years um, that you're in residency so it's a really long time and a lot of schooling before you can actually get a real first-time job but um so that was really long for me I didn't think that I could you know be in school that long and then I kind of was like what if being a surgeon, something happened to one of the kids while I was, you know, operating on them and I wouldn't be able to live with myself if something were to happen. Um, so I just kind of decided that that huge risk that was associated with that job just wasn't the best for me. So then I kind of went back into marketing and that's what I was going to be. Um, I started out college a marketing, pre-business marketing major and I was that for a few months, not very long, and then I switched into um, legal studies, which I still am. That's what I want to do. I want to go to law school and everything, but at my school, the way it works is there's these different colleges. There's like College of Nursing, College of Sports Science, and like all these other things, um, history and math. and all of those and then there's College of Business which is what I am in and within the College of Business there's these different sections that you can choose to concentrate in so there's like management or marketing human resources that sort of thing and then there's legal studies 
So the way it works is like everybody that's in the College of Business takes like the same six core classes. And then once you get those out of the way, then you can move on to take your more elective kind of type classes, which are in your concentration. So for me, being a legal studies concentration, I will take more law-based classes for my electives. So like last semester, I had a legal environment class, and this semester I have a um, law of commercial transactions class, which it just deals with like contract law and how all that works and everything. So. And that actually is what interests me the most. So after I graduate with my undergrad, I'm hoping to go to law school. I haven't taken um, the LSATs yet. I'm going to take them in October. They have one in June, but I thought that I needed, you know, a lot of time to study for them because they're a major part of if you get into a law school or not. So I thought that I could spend the whole summer, you know, studying for those instead of trying to take it over the summer. So I'm just going to take that in October and then if I don't do as well as I want, then I can take it in December again, they offer it. So that's kind of the rationale that I think I'm going to do. Hopefully it all works out. Oh heavens, I don't know what I'm going to do if it doesn't. But um, in law school, I then want to concentrate more on contract law and that sort of thing because I want to go into entertainment law. So kind of like an agent sort of, but not really for like celebrities and um, entertainment figures, personalities, sporting figures, different stuff like that. They all have an entertainment lawyer that deals with their contracts that have to do with like sponsorships and advertisements and kind of like a marketing side too. So that's basically what my major is. It's specifically, um, I am a business major with a legal studies concentration and I want to go to law school and hopefully everything pans out like I hope it will. And um, if you guys have any questions, if you're thinking about being a lawyer, going to law school, or even just help maybe um, picking out a major or a school for your major, um, just leave the comments below asking your questions and I'll try to answer them as best as I can, you know, as much as I know so far. But I hope that this gave you guys kind of an insight to who I am and what my future is hopefully holding for me. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye!